Hey, what's going on guys? It has been a little while since I've recorded anything and I wanted to jump on here and show you kind of an update video of the storage facility. Well, actually it's not really an update video, it's more of uh, kind of the pre-update video. So I was over at the facility recently when it was pouring down rain and thought I'd point out some things, um, some updates that we're gonna be making and you're gonna kind of see the before uh, during this video here and then you'll see what it looks like after the fact so um, As you can see there's a lot of standing water here uh, at the facility. This is actually the main road um, Where traffic drives by and there's a highway interstate on the other side of the facility. So I'm just gonna drive through and we're going to uh, Just kind of look at the look at the facility So you can see I've got a lot of standing water especially through here. I've got pretty much a river that's running through the facility. And then you can see the interstate. Um, got a little asphalt pad right here, but there's just a lot of drainage problems, with water coming through here and actually eating out like probably a foot deep, um, like hole, I guess more or less a, ch a channel or a ditch through there. Eventually all the water makes it down and there's a ditch that the, uh, that the state uh, maintains. but. Um, this facility also I'd like to mention, so it, it started here, this building, I uh, actually forget, I think this was built in like the, the 90s, these first like three buildings, and then as you go further back, he started adding on to the facility, so the buildings get newer and newer the further away you get from this building, so everything up front here is a little bit older. Um, and I'll point out a couple more problems, um, we've got standing water here in front of the facilities, and also notice just the gravel itself. Um, this isn't too bad, but some of the areas, especially on the other side, the gravel needs reworked. Um, there's a lot of grass that's grown up, and really the problem with it is the old owner piled just too much gravel on top of more gravel. You know, he just every time it needed gravel, he'd just add more um, instead of like digging out the old stuff and putting in new. So here's what I'm talking about. You can see um, a lot of grass. And this is all supposed to be gravel over here, and it's not. It's all practically grass. So let me pause it right there. So um, from from the side of the building all the way to over here should be gravel. And the problem with just dumping more gravel on is eventually you get the water running the wrong direction into the building. And so you know we've got to correct that by. Um, by digging some of the old stuff out, especially in the problem areas, and then replacing it. So that's one of the things you're going to see in a future video. That's something we'll be doing here, hopefully in the next uh, month or two, is up, you know, upgrading all the gravel, digging out the bad spots. And another thing that I wanted to point out is you're probably not going to really see it, see it here, but um, there's there used to be old light fixtures uh, on the old buildings, and the new buildings don't even have lights, and so. That's one thing that we're going to be doing is going through the facility and um, and replacing the lights, putting in new wall packs, LED lights that look a lot better and, and really light things up from the highway. Um, and you can see another problem area. So this has got to be dug out because we're almost to the top of the lip here. And so we want to dig that out, do kind of a V through the middle and then re-gravel it. So that's, that's something that's going to be coming up. Let me flip through here. Not that one. Uh, some videos of me drilling out one of the uh, locks. This is one of the units. Uh, but I know I've got uh, some pictures here. So here's another section. This is one of the newer buildings that's further down the line. And we're going to bring gravel out. Um, I think this is about 25 feet. It's about 10 foot, a little over 10 foot coming out right now. We're going to at least double that um, and gravel all this. So it's less yard to take care of and should be easier to maintain all around. Um, I think I'm going the wrong direction here. So here's another spot I wanted to point out. So um, this is going to have a brand new sign installed on it. So this is a, I want to say, um, now, do I have a better picture? I don't. Um, so this is, I think, 30 feet wide, this building. And so we're going to do it, um, I think the sign's going to be 28 feet by, I want to say, 7 feet. 7 by 28 is the going to be the new sign. So that's one of the other things you're going to see. Um, had my cousin open up one of the units. 
And this is this is shortly after we took over the facility. As you can see, it looked absolutely terrible. Um, dandelions everywhere. So all this is getting treated. All the gravel is going to be replaced, and it's going to look a lot better. So there's a shot of the facility from across the highway. Um, and these are the older buildings. You can see that's that one I said that started in the 90s, 90s, 90s. And then I think he started building these in 2015. He put these up all the way to here. And then over on this other side, uh, this is a building that was built in 2020, I believe. And um, that's the old phone, old phone number. And then there's a vacant lot I'll show you if I can find. Okay, right here. So this lot, um, and it has this mobile home on there, we're going to be replacing or taking down all the trees putting this whole thing turning it into a gravel lot and then eventually we'll be putting more buildings up uh, on that lot on this vacant lot which i can't remember it's not quite an acre i don't think but um pretty much this new building that you see right here that was built in 2020 we'll be doing you know three or four more buildings like that so yeah that's a little update on the storage facility and hopefully you guys will be able to see some updates coming soon. So until then, thanks for watching.